that uh, it was the disappearance festival of Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Thakur. And uh, in those uh, festivals, Prabhupada would put uh, Bhakti's Guru's uh, picture on Vyasasan. He would sit uh, down on a lower seat. And he was delivering the lecture here on that year. And then he was explaining how the previous Acharyas, when we glorify one Acharya, former Acharya, we have to glorify the others. How the secret of advancement in Krishna consciousness is really based on getting the mercy of the previous acharyas and pleasing. How we get the mercy by trying to please them, trying to do what they want us to do. So then Prabhupada was explaining how it's like Bhakti uh, Vinod Thakur had the big one rupee so all the people had built the first uh, birthplace center. Of course, you know how he found that with the help of uh, Bhakti, of uh, Jagadas, Das Babaji. How he said, my uh, Srila Bhakti, um, Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Thakur, he built the uh, Chaitanya Mahat and the Jogpit temple. And then... So like this Prabhupada, he was uh, very emotional, he said that in my humble way, I'm also trying to do something to develop my poor Navadip Dham. He said, I'm very grateful for all the devotees who are helping me to develop my poor Dham. And then he couldn't speak anyway, he just choked up and tears were pouring from his eyes. <laughs> We were sitting there. Actually, we haven't been able to do much for Srila Prabhupada, but still just whatever little anyone was doing, we can understand. He was so appreciative. Then he, after he could gather his composure again, then he again said that this pleasing the previous acharyas is the secret to Krishna conscious advancement. We know how all the previous acharya, right from because we know our, our, our Adi Guru, Nityananda Prabhu, as, as Bhakti Nava said, has predicted that Akadbhut Mandir Hoive Pokash, Goranga Nitya Seva Hoive Vikash. So Prokash means to manifest, and Vikash means to expand. So by this temple manifesting, the message of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu will expand all over the world, Prabhupada said. Evil. How many of you want to see Lord Chaitanya's message expand all over the world? Evil. How many want to please to the Prabhupada and the previous Acharyas? Evil. How many want to fulfill the prediction of Lord Nityananda? How many want to let someone else do it? <laughs> How many want to mercy yourselves? Want to be part of this Maha Yajna? <laughs> Srinivas Acharya was on a tour of Mayapur. He went on a parikrama after it was over. He was lying down that evening in the house, the original house. Same original house was there. The same grass hut of Sachimata and Jagannath Mitra. He was looking and he said, The Supreme Personality of Godhead, the Lord of the Anantakoti Brahmanda, the, the most merciful avatar, he lived in a grass hut. He came here as a Brahmana. And he was just like, just like overwhelmed. How, how is it? We're hearing so many glories <coughs> now that they've done, but we, we don't, you know, with our muscles, eyes, with our flesh eye, we don't see everything. We feel it, we hear it. So it was like you're overwhelmed. What, how to put all this information together. Then about midnight he dozed off and Lord Chaitanya picked him up. Came and gave him a vision and picked him up and flew him in the sky and gave him an aerial view of the transcendental 
Navadip Dam and he saw a spiritual city with so many temple-like houses and people all very beautiful with tilak on and golden wall around the city. And then he saw this beautiful temple in the middle. It's just something like so it's something like a dome or a, like a, some kind of a canopy or something. <coughs> Kandoga was the word in Bengali. Something like a dome temple. Then they went inside and they saw the Panchatattva, but they weren't there living. The deities were really Lord Chaitanya, every, all were there. And there were thousands and tens of thousands of devotees worshipping them from all different countries and different races, people in like he, people he didn't recognize, people with different <laughs> colors and complexions and and then everyone was worshipping them a big kirtan arti for the Panchatatwa. Like this he had seven visions, different dams, different lilas in that temple. So I Lokanath Maharaj said that temple is here, but it's aprakat, it's not visible to us yet. We want to, Lord Nityananda said that temple will become prakash, it will become manifest. So that's what we are praying is somehow that the Lord causes mercy, if He uses us as an instrument in His hands, that will be very, very grateful and very we want the Apple to do that seva, but we know that actually it's the Lord's desire, the Acharya's desire, they want it. Simply use us as a nimitta matra, as an instrument in their hands. Somehow we want very quickly this temple to manifest so that Lord Chaitanya's message will expand all over the world. Gauranga! Thank you for watching our videos. Be sure to subscribe to our channel. We publish new videos every day. And don't forget to like and share our channel.